For the first time in the United Kingdom, a baby has been born using a new technique that involves DNA from three people to help prevent the inheritance of incurable diseases. The name of this pioneering IVF technique is Mitochondrial Donation Treatment abbreviated as MDT or Mitochondrial Replacement Therapy abbreviated as MRT. The offspring born via this technique is also commonly referred as a three-parent baby because of the fact that it involves a woman giving birth to an IVF baby with DNA from three individuals, though more than 99.8% of the DNA in the babies comes from the mother and father. This technique is meant for those parents who have a high risk of passing on debilitating and even fatal genetic diseases to their children. UK had granted legal approval to this technique in 2015. The world's first baby created from DNA from three parents was born in Mexico in 2016 with the help of a New York-based team. Mitochondria are a double-membrane cellular organelle which is responsible for generating energy. They are commonly known as the powerhouse of the cell, but what really makes them unique is that they are divided independently of the cell. They consist of a very small genome of their own which in many ways duplicate that of more primitive life forms. The mitochondrial DNA controls its functions much like the rest of any living form and decides how the organism would look and act. Mitochondria hold almost 0.0005% of our entire DNA but the child receives it only from the mother. This makes any aberrations in mother's mitochondrial DNA that may cause diseases is passed on completely to the child. Disorders of the brain, muscles, heart, nervous system and liver many of them fatal or life-limiting are linked to defective mitochondria. Such mitochondrial diseases are incurable and affect around 1 in 6500 children worldwide. Mitochondrial donation treatment uses tissue from the eggs of healthy female donors to create IVF embryos that are free from harmful mutations their mothers carry and are likely to pass on to their children. Because the embryos combine sperm and egg from the biological parents, with tiny battery-like structures called mitochondria from the donor's egg, the resulting baby has DNA from the mother and father as usual plus a small amount of genetic material from the donor. Britain requires that every woman undergoing the treatment be approved by its fertility regulator which says there must be no other options available for the family to avoid passing on genetic disease. Till date, 32 patients have been given the green light to receive such treatment.